both of us observed anger out of control in our homes. In our homes, there was definitely yelling. Uh, there could be physical violence. Screaming. It, we saw a lot of the ugliness of anger. Mm -hmm. And we both reacted in our own different ways to that. Yeah. You know, I vowed I was never going to be like my dad. Mm -hmm. Which to me meant holding in emotions. And when I got married to my first wife, uh, and there were things I didn't like, I would hold it in, hold it in, hold it in, and then I would explode. And we'd have a talk about all the things I didn't like that had gone on the previous two months. <laughs> you know, and then I would hold it in, hold it in again, same thing would happen. And then slowly, I learned to not wait two months of holding it in till I would express something. You know, maybe I got it down to a couple of weeks. Mm. And, but, you know, I still never had great tools in that relationship, which is why we got divorced. And she wouldn't own her her half of the issues we had. You know, ultimately, that's why we split. So I'd like to make a distinction. Well, I'd like to talk first about what anger is. And I'd like to separate that from what we do with it. 